I'm Emma. And I'm Lucille. And, and this, this is, is our college door tour. tour. Woo! Tour. This is our official last night in our dorm, and they're moving out. Um, it's sad. We're sad, but I'm gonna give you guys a little tour of our home for the past year. Our little nook, cranny. <laughs> I'm giving you guys a tour of three, two, three, place to be, baby. And at the very end, we're gonna announce what dorm we've been living in. So if you go to Tech or coming to Tech, um, pick our dorm because it's the best one. Can't really see another dorm trying to cross us. <laughs> Who goes Tech, me, boo? <laughs> Um, also, at the end, we're gonna have a surprise appearance by most likely our RA. We'll tell you what a pleasure we've been over the past year. So, if you guys want to see the freaking best dorm tour on the internet, then just keep watching. Yeah. Okay, so this is the outside of our dorm. We have our handicap bell. <laughs> no. We have our signs. Since we're in leadership, we had to make these experience VT strengths. And we're the exact opposite. <laughs> we have our signs here, as you can see, 323 handicap room. This is our door from when I was coming back from California. Howdy is very, very important. <laughs> so is move out. Here's a general overview. So here's what our dorm looks like. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna give you guys an in-depth tour of our room and all of the gross shit that's happened in here in the past year. Put your seatbelts, it's gonna be a fun ride. This is our little bathroom area. We have a huge light up mirror which actually opens. And we have like toiletries, um, stain remover, nail polish remover, makeup, various hairbrushes, retainers. <laughs> <laughs> then we have our little mini mirror, which none of us have actually ever used, but it's kind of really it nice. Moves. And it moves! Wow. <laughs> and then we have the back mirror too. But this is what our thing looks like. We got lucky and got a sink in our dorm. It's kind of crusted because it was frat cooler painting season. That's true. So it's either paint or mold, we don't really know, but it could be one of the two. We have our little section that has like our lotions and deodorants and skincare. <laughs> we have our tooth, actually these are all the seals toothbrushes. So, we have our toothbrushes, um, really important. This is Lucille's toothbrush. <laughs> In the very beginning of the year, I was very scared because she brushes her teeth so aggressively. Um, and I keep mine separate because they get scared of hers. We have our little corner which we have soaps and dishes. We put all our dirty dishes. I never do dishes. <laughs> Hand towel, air freshener. We have cabinetry right here. It, like I have a drawer here that has like hair care and deodorant. And then this drawer has miscellaneous stuff like face masks, a really dirty self-tan towel, um, hand sanitizer. The bottom drawer has like more hair care, more Aussie stuff, and like usually our hot tools. Then underneath the sink, we have all this space because it is a handicap room. You open up and this is where we keep our recycling bin, our dirty dishes and our essentials, dish cleaning set. We have a mat right here that's really dirty and hasn't been washed once <laughs> this year. This mirror is an iconic mirror that we've taken a selfie in every single, pretty, almost every single day. I'll, oh my gosh, I'm gonna do a little montage. Oh, Cue good. Mirror Selfie Montage now. Wow. Over here we have Lucille's side of the room and then my side's over there. This is our mirror that we take pictures in pretty much also every day. We have our special notes. Favorite sticky note to say you win some, you lose most. Trust no one, not even yourself, <laughs> not even yourself, self. Really encouraging, positive notes just get me through the day. Really great stuff. We have these paper doilies that I put up in the very <laughs> beginning of the year, which no longer <laughs> stick to the wall. Our temperature over here, which thankfully has been really great this year, and actually we do have AC, which has been pretty amazing, because otherwise I would have killed somebody. <laughs> This is my shower towel. My other shower towel is super nice. This is my holy area. Um, this is my Polaroid wall with all the people that I love before college and during college and after college. And um, if you can't tell what sorority I'm in, I'm <laughs> in DG. And throw so throw a quick one. <laughs> but all of these for my big and my G big are super talented. And this little L that my friend Salma gave me. This is also for my big and anchored by the symbols of DG. This is Barry. 
a staple in the room. A staple. And then these are my silk pillowcases, which are really good for your skin and hair, so I definitely recommend getting them. <laughs> Our room is a triple, so this is the third bed. It's, it sleeps right here. She sleeps um, right here. <laughs> here, I have this hat that I won from a game with lacrosse boys. <laughs> I have my crosses there. I have three is my lucky number, so I have one from my grandma, my mom, my cousin, and then these are just beads that I got from Bid Day. Virginia Tech painting and from my grad party that my friend Addie gave me. And then this is my desk. She has never used, not once. <laughs> so here we have just some water bottles, one, one I got from Bid Day, one I've had forever, my DG makeup thing that my big gave me, a plant from Emma, my mirror that I never used, composites, <laughs> Emma also gave me this and says, good things are going to happen, and they did. So, oh. These are my letters, my DG pen, some pictures of people that I love, my family and my friends, and then my friend Tanner, since I've had this in seventh grade, so I had to bring it to college That was me. in the dorm, like the move, and I was yes. like, our friend Tanner is sitting right and there. Be in the apartment next year, so. Framed. <laughs> yep. And then big sticky note girl, one of my favorite quotes from this year. These are the golden days. You might not know it now, but you'll see it from years from now, which is our friend Andrew said at about 2 a.m. <laughs> we have this like little caddy of school supplies, my Fuji film, which I'll get developed after freshman year. Yay! And then this lamp. <laughs> <laughs> my fidget spinner. You never think you need a spinner, fidget spinner until you need it. So, <laughs> chapstick for when I kiss Emma. Oh, oh my god. And then just miscellaneous things in my camera. These are just my clothes. And then for like textbooks and my camera bag. And then this is my ottoman because Emma's tall to jump on her bed, but I am not. So she just has shoes and stuff and old costumes. Would you like to hear as a demonstration? <laughs> of jumping? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Stretching is very important. <laughs> yeah! Oh! Bed has other random things, a bunch of shoes that I'd wear like day parties for Mozart or Rush. Printer we never set up because never. we're neuroscience majors, not engineers. <laughs> <laughs> Highly recommend getting this for your dorm. Can't remember what it's called again. Extension cord. Extension cord, which has just different chargers and stuff. So, this is my side. Since we did get a triple, we have like the desk and the like the drawers and the closet of a third person, but we did hide the third bed back there because we never got assigned a third roommate. So we made this like the general area space. Over here we have our favorite sign which says, you only freshman year once, E plus L plus K plus K, three, two, three. That's me, Lucille, Kate, and Katie. And then we have hand sanitizer, very important so we don't get sick. I only ended up getting sick twice this year. Lucille was sick every <laughs> single week. Um, we have multivitamins, also very, very important. We have a countdown till each holiday just to keep us in our spirits when we want to cry at night. <laughs> this we have a plant from Ikea, Lucille's signature perfume that we use a lot. Um, stolen Tabasco sauce from West End. Borrowed. <laughs> Borrowed. Re we'll return. Important Zyrtec because allergies just kill you here. We have our microwave which has only been used for mac and cheese and tea. And don't forget popcorn. popcorn. Then we have this our nice fridge with our magnets we got from Move In. Um, we had a Brita first semester and then gave up. Um, in here you'll find old <laughs> almond milks smoothies, various bottles, stolen frat hummus, face masks, reusable ice cubes, miscellaneous, <gasps> moldy probably drinks, oh, limes that, oh my god, are also molding. Moldy limes. <laughs> then over here we have our TV, which my dad set up and it has like everything. We use it to like watch football games or the office. Sometimes ratatouille, whatever we're feeling. Ratatouille. We have our Alexa right here, which has saved our lives. We play like music on it every single day and underneath we have all of our cords, Lucille's fruit cups and these are like various packages I usually keep in the corner. This is a hard hat that our friends left in here for when they were initiated to their frat. Don't know what we're gonna do with it but she just lives there now. This is a miscellaneous drawer filled of just like beauty stuff, extra paint, themed holiday decor. <laughs> Up here is like random stuff we got from moving, like a dry erase thing, a bunch of flyers, our rubber mallet that we used to hammer the beds together, chapstick, a single expo <laughs> marker. These pull out, which oh. is really nice. This is my desk. This is where I like to work on my homework or miscellaneous. Lucille does not use a desk, she uses this as her desk. Okay. Each thing has this, which is really nice when you're like sitting with people, you can put your feet up or you can like do homework if we ever actually do that. Mm -hmm. This is our pantry. This is like our random assortment of like drawers. Uh, cups, coffee, tea, Ziploc baggies. Sanders. <laughs> and this is our pantry drawer. It used to be really good and now this is like <laughs> the remnants. This is the graveyard of what we have here. This was my dinner one time and that sums up. College. Basically, this has been multiple meals where we just eat <laughs> dates, nuts, pita 
butter, <laughs> more Sorry. medicine. You get really sick in college all the time. You get really sick in college. <laughs> this is our Keurig that has been used approximately three times. <laughs> I really thought that I was gonna use it every single day, but we just microwave water for tea and we just go to buy coffee mm -hmm. for coffee. A coffee sign that means a lot, but was never <laughs> used. Over here is our third closet, which we keep cleaning supplies up here. And then in this closet, I keep like random jackets, extra clothes, um, water bottles, plastic bags for our thing, um, random cleaning stuff, our vacuum that doesn't never work, used. never used, body wash. <laughs> <laughs> closet has a mirror on the back, so this has a little mirror, which is super fun. This is our very dirty carpet from Target. As you can see, it's covered in paint, mud stains, tears, dust bunnies, and this is a paint spill that we literally never clean up ever because we know that we're throwing this away the second that we're over with it. Behind the door is our shoe corner. We have our nice shoes, and this is where frat shoes go to die. Um, if you're gonna be a college freshman, bring make sure you bring shoes to wear out, and they will literally get annihilated. But behind the door, we have our shower caddies filled with like our shampoos and loofahs and stuff. <laughs> and over here, we have our two giant closets. This is Lucille's, it has stuff on top, and this is mine that has my little caddy with like sunglasses and shoes and stuff in it. So, this is what's inside my closet rain jacket, essential, and then actually, not having essential because Emma just doesn't have one <laughs> but then a bunch of like nicer clothes for day parties formals and stuff like that a business thing that I wore to my housing contract meeting but shirts some extra pillowcases and then just hung up my belt and headbands right here hey yo we back substitute vlogger <laughs> no last time for a little bit she said she'll come visit so shout out the boy young shout out Katie <laughs> it's a good semester we out kids Okay, so this is my closet. I have all my sunglasses. This is where everybody comes to take pictures and they take glasses <laughs> and put it on and then go take mirror selfies. We have like hair care, scrunchies, random shoes, um, vacuum pieces, date party shoes, sunglasses. This is my inside of my closet. We have I made it throughout the entire year without getting a rain jacket <laughs> and I walked to every single class in the rain with a sweatshirt on so it can be done. We have various windbreakers, a couple date party dresses, Halloween costumes. That were never worn. That were never worn. <laughs> um, a bunch of like tech gear as you can see. In the bottom I have like my towels and like random stuff like that I folded doesn't fit like formal dresses. This is the overview of my desk. I have my little fan things right here and then I have a bunch of stuff like on the inside of this wall. So this is like my memory wall. I have my Mickey Mouse ears from when I went to Disney with Dote. I have this pass that I got from going to the Teen Vogue conference in LA with Ozzy. Lucille wrote me a note when I was gone for Coachella. I have uh, Polaroids of me and my friends when I was on the Dote trip. I have this from Atlanta when I went to Music Midtown. More Disneyland stuff, my Endgame stub tickets because it was such a good movie. I have my The Future Is Now poster, and I hung up these little command hooks and organized my jewelry on here. Over in this corner, I have like all my skincare. It's like mostly Glossier stuff. This is where like I do like my night routine kind of deal. This is all my makeup storage, as you can see. I have like powders and uh, bronzer blush, chapstick, mascara, eyebrow gel, and then like nail polish and other stuff in these. They're really helpful for organizing the top of your desk. Over here is a combination of a pencil holder and my like makeup brush thing. I have this fancy jewelry thing that swings out like this so I can access all of it. Really helpful this year and has a lot of my jewelry in it. Here's a picture of me and Izzy from homecoming last year. Then over here is like my bedside table corner. I have my diffuser, my neon coffee sign, my daily jewelry, and this is like my mailbox key my perfume this is like random essential oils retainers sleep chocolates these are either letters that I've sent to people or have come to me from home or like birthday cards and stuff and then this is like a bunch of like tech stuff and once again like more letters this is my miscellaneous drawer I have slime from when I bought slime for the fall I have Peppa Pig band-aids I have a couple different headphones a couple different poof balls my calculator which is dead my retainer case this is just like all textbooks and stuff I have like a little fur thing that matches Lucille's that I put in the back of my desk chair so it looks like this. This is like an overview of my bed and like all the stuff that's underneath it. Underneath my bed is not the most organized so I already moved some of it out but this is like my laundry bag, a basket for other stuff, my backpack, traveling suitcase, and here is my air mattress for when friends come over and like other sweatshirts. I have like my tripod and my filming stuff right there and like more clothes that I haven't put away yet. So this is like my dresser underneath my bed and so I have like socks and underwear in here and this is like pants.
pants and leggings. Underneath here I have like all my t-shirts and stuff so I fold them like this so I can like make sure there's like a lot of room because I had a lot of clothes this year. And on the corner of my bed I have these little bags that I've, I was sent this year and I have this little, my friends call it the cat toy but I have it hanging on the end of my bed just for decor. I would highly recommend getting one of these over the bed little basket things. I keep like my water bottle, retainers, any like before bed essentials right there. And up on my bed I have my silver play button. I have like my lights up here and I have a bunch of photos of like me and my friends that were actually from my grad party that I got on this little thing right here and put them all in which is super cute. Then I have more pictures of me and my friends right above my headboard that I kind of put on these little clips and I have this nasty women flag pendant thing that I got from Richmond and this is like what my corner looks like. I have a bunch of different pillows. That's my stuffed dog Mr. Darcy that I sleep with every night. This is our favorite chair that initially we had two of that we took from our friends rooms downstairs. Shout out Zoomy and Burdick. It's the end of the year so the chair is officially broken. The other one broke a long time ago but this is like the most comfortable chair ever and this is where like a lot of our hangouts would happen and it's very sad so RIP the chair. This was like basically our second air mattress of the entire room because everybody would sleep here. And Lucille and I are going to show you her Polaroid wall because we took a photo, our very first Polaroid ever, <laughs> on this wall. This is our very first picture together ever. It's me on FaceTime and her. Yes. And Ari. First picture ever. We also snagged a really good view. We have like a quad in the middle over here. We can be pretty much seen all of this. In the corner is a basketball and a volleyball court. And then we have a jungle gym across the way. So that was our dorm tour. I hope you guys enjoyed. We're now going to announce what dorm we lived in this whole time. So if you're going to go to Virginia Tech or you are at Virginia Tech. Um. um. <laughs> if you guys want to know what dorm we live in, we live in. Oshag! Just some background facts. Oshag was renovated last summer, so everything's super brand new and nice. Somehow we did get a triple with two people. It's also handicapped. So, so it's normal rooms are not this size at all. We just really lucked out. And this has been the best dorm ever. So it has been. Thank you, 3234, everything. Oshag 323, place to be. <laughs> we're here with people from our hall and we're gonna ask our RA questions about how we were this year as his resident. <laughs> You guys were great. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take some time to reflect. Okay. Um, Andrew, what's your first memory of meeting us? Andrew, I have to Andrew was eventually. watching your video out in the lounge, oh. and then one of your friends walked up in the elevator and just busted out laughing. Yeah. Oh. Do you remember that? No. You were in the elevator. And I was like, oh, this is cool. Like, that's my resident. <laughs> Actually, no. The best one of you was like, do you remember like when I overheard you talking to someone like, oh yeah, I'm a YouTuber. Oh yeah. And I was like, wait, we, I have a YouTuber here? And I like came in here and was like. Yeah, you were like, wait, you do YouTube? And I was like, yeah. Yeah, and the then flag. your dad was like, yeah. And I was like, <laughs> yeah. My dad was like, that's gonna get you so many friends. Like, yeah. No, please no. Seal, um. What's your favorite memory of me? Oh, do you remember that time I was like, oh, us Asians gotta stick together? <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever get us in trouble? Trouble. Did we ever get a CR? YouTube? No, did we? Not from not from my lot. No. We never got a CR, baby. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. We kept trying to get you guys to play any real sports and <laughs> volleyball sports. and everything. Volleyball. <laughs> Our RA Andrew. And we love him. Oh. <laughs>